What is up? I'm Moana Turtle, and we have another Yugi opening. We're going with another 2019 Mega Ten. These still are very enjoyable to open. I feel like the yeah, just the cards they have in there, and kind of like how useful the cards are in the current meta game. They did a really good job of selecting them. As a result, uh, I feel like from all angles, like there's still a lot of cards that you can pull and it's not like oh if you don't get that one card you're you lose out from this whole tin and at the same time if, I feel like if you're a player there's a lot of cards that you know have become a lot more affordable as a result of this tin and obviously that's the whole idea of these mega tins where it's all reprints and stuff like that so I feel like on all angles just a great um, new product the tin itself is a little bit smaller, but I think that makes it a little bit easier to store cards, even sleeve cards. That's the one thing about the Pokemon tins. Like, wonder that like, uh, is it an octagon, like oblong octagon thing? It's very awkward to put cards in there, but when it's like a square, much easier. <laughs> All right, let's get into our first pack for this Mega Tin. We got Goki the Giant Ogre, Altergeist Pixiel, World Legacy World Wand. Koki Bear Hug, Boral Regenerator, Will the Solomon Great, Cyber Switch, and then World Legacy Secession. I don't think that's the great one. Nightmare Cer Cerberus, and then a Noble Knight. So, first pack wasn't anything too crazy. As far as what we want to pull, uh, obviously some of the uh, is it Danger Jackalope, Boralode Sword, Boral Sword Dragon. Be cool, called by the grave. So many cool cards. Wouldn't mind some Thunder Dragon stuff. I don't have a lot. FA Dark Dragster. Training for Hire. Salmon Great Mirror. Necro Fusion. Then a Great Fly. And Crusadia Equimax. Eh. Ooh, this is a cool one. Sky Striker Mecha Widow Anchor. I think this is like an example of a card like Sky Strikers. From what I hear, I think they're still good, uh, but the Widow Anchor just has become a lot more affordable, and I think they reprinted a lot of the links. I think uh, Ray is that the non-link one is in here as well, so a lot of good stuff. Engages in here again, which not so great about that one. <laughs> After purchasing a bunch of them from the Battle Legend set, and oh boy, this is a fast opening. We're gonna slow roll this one. We got Evelis Cosmo. Brain, Cosm Brain, World Legacy, my and like there's so despite the fact there's so many cards like commons, I still feel like I don't haven't seen them all, so that's cool too. We got a Vorticular Dragon. Ooh, what is this? Pencil Plume. That's kind of weird, but all right, let's do a quick pack trick. Secret, Ultra, and then Rare. Let's go like this. And actually, I still don't know and know much about the No Name promos. But that would be sick to get one of those. Vendra Daybreak. Crusadia Regu Regulex. Alright, so there's that weird pencil. And then Hip. <laughs> Hip Hoshin again. Ultra is. Beat Bladesman for Hire. These for Hires are kind of weird. And for our last pack, our Prismatic Secret Rare is. Ah, Timeton again. We got one of those in the recent openings. Don't think that card's that great. All right, on to the promos. Let's get some guy cards. Let's get a Nibiru, Ruler No More. What else is in there? Still all the ones I can't think of. All right, Neo Kaiser Glider. Ooh, nice. Blue Eyes Alternative Ultimate Dragon. Kind of hard to see, make out all like the stuff going on there, but that looks really cool. You can look at that real quick. Monster Reborn, always a cool card. We're Gekki. So like these are like day zero of Yu-Gi-Oh. These cards were available and they're still like promo. So these things are timeless. And our last one is a Dimension Shifter. When I first saw that, I thought it said something else. So um, I feel like as far as the tins go, this was probably our most lackluster one. But even that one was a real joy to open. So if you haven't picked up one of these, um. I would say, and if you're into Yu-Gi-Oh, I would say get at least one. It is a really cool opening. And oh, last thing, oh, I forgot, I should have mentioned this earlier. 
Um, if you're interested in doing a pack battle for one of these Megatons, uh, hit me up on Instagram or on Discord, link down below. Uh, it's a little bit easier to kind of coordinate things on one of those things versus in YouTube comments. So hit me up if you want to do a battle. I still have a good amount of these tins to open. Uh, so yeah, let me know. Other than that, guys, okay opening, but had a blast. Uh, but thanks for watching. I'm Moana Turtle, and I'll catch you guys next time.